Uh, you found a nice round patch of dirt that you'd like to divide up into as many different garden plots as possible. You have five ropes to work with. Each one must be stretched in a straight line across the circle. But the rope can cross each other as often as you'd like. Using only these five ropes, can you... Or what is the maximum number of sections you can divide the patch of dirt into? Ken says it should be easy. Okay, so... I think the obvious path here... Each one must be stretched in a straight line across the circle, but the ropes can cross each other as often as you like. So the easy answer is to just go like this. One, two, or one, two, three, four. We can get a little bit better here. Alright, this this would be the the obvious approach. Okay, one, two, three, four. Which would give us eight on uh eight total uh Dividing. And then if we go like this again, uh, we get two more, so ten. But it's a 50 pick a wrap puzzle. Um. straight line across the circle. So I'm wondering if you can do shenanigans like this. One, two, three, four. Really like to clean this up, but uh, so we have four on the poles, and then one, two, three in the centers. So that would be six in the centers and eight on the outside. That would be fourteen. If I have my math correctly, one, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, so we have 14 if we do like a basketball approach. And this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 ropes. Okay, so we're at 14. Uh, how much more goofy can we do this? about we did something like that a little bit more What does this give me? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Not good enough. They don't need to start next to each other. Up to at least 15 now, and each new rope crosses all previous ropes. 
So if our basketball was the best we've done so far, horrible. Over for our basketball is the best we have How can we angle these to give more plots? quick what does something like that do uh, one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen one, two, three, four, five, six. So that would still be 14. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So what about... We keep this particular idea going here. Does that come out to be the same thing as well? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay. No matter where I put that center, it won't matter. Very, very interesting. Ken says it's up to 15. I can only get 14. I'll go ahead and lose my Picarats with the 14, and then we'll go with Ken's 15. Here's my answer. I guess it's back to the drawing board. Uh, you got 16? I'm definitely curious how they, how they go about that one. Let's see if Ken's got it with 16. Hmm, how about this? Well Phew, done. That's a relief. Oh. Oh, a star. Excellent. You can divide the patch of, or the patch of dirt into as many as 16 sections. Uh, the first rope divides the circle into two sections. The second rope divides it into four. The third rope crosses the first two and divides the patch into seven sections. Once you've used up all five ropes, like this, you end up with 16 sections. A simple example is a star in the center, as shown in the image above. Okay, I wasn't even thinking about no stars. All right, the top or the black top hat below is made from six blocks using the same pieces. Uh, 
Uh, using the same pieces, make a white top hat in the same spot. Pieces can be moved and rotated with your stylus. Star was your initial? And some playing around, moving stuff around? Okay. A white top hat. Okay. This will be the top. Like so. Just get these pieces out of the way. I, I, I want to move you. How do I move you? Same spot. Just moving out of the area. Solution. I I was raw talk. I was thinking about doing something like that, but it looks like there's no submit button, so uh, it doesn't look like that will work. I think I'm thinking too small. Gosh, I still have this gargantuan piece, man. to make the border around the thing you're pretty sure so the C would be the edge around one of the rims of the hat the border I was thinking I need to use this white space right here that's how I interpret it White top hat, black border around the white. Yeah, but then why would there be white here? Not that I'm trying to make excuses for this, this puzzle or anything.
Is this your solution, Ken? Because... This one's as good as sold. I think that's the solution. No puzzle can stop Layton's apprentice. Okay. Okay. Smooth. What a beautiful white top hat. Well, that was truly impressive. I like my way better. They should have done it that way. Oh, Nakuri is streaming. Oh my goodness. Oh, hey, it's one of these. Four canned food products are randomly stacked. Uh, 14 moves. Let's see, six cans at a time. time to write down the locations you could take a screenshot ken and open up paint and paste it in there come on man making me tell you how to work a computer over here that's cheating <laughs> you use pen and paper wow you're wasting ink and paper when you could be wasting pixels instead Fatal mistake here. I don't have enough moves to rectify this. Did I just move that one right there? If, if I just move that... No, I, I'm... Okay, I know what I did. have it but this one's a little tough
I need to combine, try to combine them with every move is my goal here. Stay right there. of those. Got it. Woo. Here's my answer. Took everything. I was dangerously close to screwing it up. It. I like those ones. How many moves did it take? It took all of my moves. Messenger done. 